Detroit's Senior Olympics is back for its 37th year. And if you're looking to win a medal or two, we have all the information for you. Sandra, tell us more. Hey, Rochelle, you know what? These are some neat medals, too. I'm here with Tracy Jackson, who's with the Detroit Senior Olympics. We're so glad to have you here with us today. Thank you for having me. Give us a little bit of an idea. This has been an event that's been going on in the city for a really long time. What's it all about? So this is all about seniors being active and having a great lifestyle. And some of these seniors, I'm telling you, I tell them all the time every year when I grow up, I want to be just like them. I mean, seriously, they are impressive because we're not just talking about seniors who are taking a stroll around the block. Oh, no. Oh, they're, they're putting in some effort. They're putting in some effort. They're playing bounce volleyball. They're playing golf. They're doing track and field events. They're bowling. I mean, just it's so many different events and they can register for up to six events. And they get out there and they dance and they are baking and arts and crafts. It's just amazing. And there's still time for folks to register, right? Tell us a little bit about the deadline and some of the different categories and how you can go about participating. Absolutely. So we have several different levels of participation. Um, you can be a spectator and you can go all the way up to an athlete. Like I said, register for six events. Um, registration ends May 12th. Um, so it's coming up right around the corner. Coming up, it's right around the corner. It's on Mother's Day. And um, we want everybody to just register, come out. Even if you just want to see what it's about, register to be a spectator so you can be in the event and have a great time. So we're sharing some of that info right there um, for folks to be able to register. Really quickly, you got to tell me what is the hardest event in your opinion and then the easiest. You mentioned baking. So <laughs> the hardest event for me would be the swimming events they do some swimming events. so they do some swimming events. absolutely absolutely so long distance so yes they do um freestyle they do um backstroke are we talking 50s here hundreds 25 so it's 50. okay it's 50 and uh they are amazing that is impressive i love it what a great event what a great way to focus on being healthy and positive absolutely thank you so much tracy for being here